Okay, welcome to our lecture online. And our next word problem deals with ratios. So what we have here is a person whose distance from the ground to the, to the person's eyes is five feet. The person has a stick eight feet tall and wants to know how tall a tree is. So what he does is he sticks the stick into the ground so that eight feet of it sticks above the, the ground and he sticks the stick 120 feet away from the tree and then he, he walks backwards until the line from his eyes to the top of the stick meets the top of the tree. And that happens to be at a distance of 10 feet away from the stick. The question is, can you help this person figure out how tall the tree is? And so what we want to do is we want to do a ratio of triangles. And the best way to do that is to draw a line from the eyeballs all the way over to the tree, like this. And now we have two triangles. We have the small triangle, which is this triangle right here. And we have the big triangle, which is this triangle right here. And those are congruent, as we'd call it. They have the same angles, the same ratios. And so what we want to do is ra um, uh, give, give the relative heights or the relative sizes of those triangles. And so we can say that the height from there to there, since it's five feet to the eyeballs and eight feet to the top of the stick, we know that this is three feet and the distance here of that triangle is 10 feet. So I have a small triangle right here. The vertical length is three and the horizontal length is 10. Then we have the big triangle right here. And we can see here that this distance, let's call that small h. Small h would be the distance from five feet above the ground to the top of the tree. That means that big H is simply small h plus five. And we can then say that this height then would be small h and this distance right here would be 120 plus 10 or 130 feet. So now we have two triangles where these angles are the same right here and the dimension ratios are the same. So therefore we can say that three divided by 10, the ratio of the vertical side divided by the horizontal side must equal the vertical side divided by the horizontal side of the large triangle. And we can then solve this for H. What we can do here is um, cross multiply, make the 130 go up here. So this would be three times 130 divided by 10, which is equal to H. So these zeros, the 10 cancels out the zero of the 130. And so we can say that 39 is equal to small h. And since big H is equal to small h plus five feet, then big H is equal to 39 plus five, which is 44. So we can conclude, since all the dimensions are in feet, that the height of the tree is 44 feet tall. And that's how we do that. Very straightforward. Using this technique is very practical and will come up a lot in all kinds of different situations. So triangles that have the same relative dimensions and that have the same angles like this can be easily used to come up with a ratio scheme in which you can find certain dimensions by setting the ratio of one equal to the ratio of the other. And that's how we do that.